Hey everyone, let's continue playing Wind Waker. Well, well. Tingle Island. Um, something about the island over there. The guy who lives there is named Tingle, but he won't grow up and act his age. He still dresses like a little kid. Still, from what I hear, he can decipher maps like nobody's business. Just goes to show you that you can't judge a person on their appearance alone. Of course, the thing about this Tingle guy is that when it comes to time to pay his deciphering fee, you'd better be ready to fork over some serious dough. Anyone who doesn't have a deep wallet won't be reading any maps, that's for sure. Okay, well, we'll do that at some other point. I don't want to do that right now. Um, what's this way? Okay, yeah, let's go. Let's go downward. Let's go in the downward direction. Real quick, let me go back to the map. There we go. show great fish aisle yep you should come around these parts on nights when just a wee bit of the left half of the moon is missing that's when it appears all right so the ghost ship the ghost ship will appear here oh it's time for you to return to your home. We must sail to Alstead Island. Okay, I don't know where that is. <laughs> Thank you for the encouragement, but... Fish. Come over here so I can get out. This place creeps me out. There's flying fish that want to eat me. Any small fry? Uh, in real life, I'm, uh, I'd consider myself like at least a medium fry, with some like extra salt on it, but yeah, that's just me. Um, well, those things are says treasure. All right, just tell me about treasure. I really need to stop jumping out of the boat every single time I do that. There you go. Hey, small fry. Alright, so outset must be on one of the corner, one of the edges then. Um, a fan pictographer. Why is talented? Legendary. Okay. I already actually have that picto box. Okay, come on, David. Stay inside of your boat for two seconds. I'm just gonna throw it away. Only so I can buy like a fresh three berries, you know? Oh, he has bombs. Oh, wait, what? Wait. The red. Oh, I need an empty bottle for that. 30 bombs, 30 rupees. Oh, yeah, where, where's your bait at, dude? I was. Okay, well, I just totally threw a, a bait, just wasted it. But, um, that's alright, I guess. I still have six more. I'm hoping he gets bait back in his shop, though, because that's kind of what I was looking for here. A giant boulder if I can blow up a giant boulder I think I can blow up a little piece of wood let's see though maybe I'm proven wrong 
Yeet. Whoopsies. Yeet. Whoopsies again. All right, here we go. All right, good stuff. All right, let's see what we get. Wallet upgrade, maybe. Health upgrade, maybe. Maybe, maybe. What you got for me? I am really funny, so. Young Waker of the Winds, allow me to aid you in your quest. I appreciate that. You're my best friend. <laughs> I don't need more bombs. Why are you giving me so many bombs? I need more wallet size, bro. Well, I'm glad I can hold 99 bombs, but I've used the solid four so far. I mean, okay, guys, okay. I gotta stop complaining. Oh. I have to stop complaining. An upgrade's an upgrade, but... Yeet. There we go. Yeah, like an upgrade is an upgrade. I gotta stop complaining, but still. I, I'm just really hoping for a wallet upgrade here, you know? Uh, 200 is not that many rupees. Alright. Well, I want to go the opposite direction here. Alright, we've got most of the middle mapped out now. Shark Island. We just need to get the all of the edges. Which is going to take a hot minute, but... Tell me. Blah, blah, blah. Windy City, you want to spend so much time... Wait, what did he say? Hold on, you know what I'm going to do? Can I... Oh, man, I kind of wanted to hear that again. You know what? Whatever. I'll... I'll... Yeah, I don't know what's with, like, the fish dialogue that it just, like, it... The temptation to skip it is just so strong. What is this? Outset. Oh my god, that's Outset Island. It's been there the whole time. I'm just dumb. Alright. Okay. Well, then I'm done with finding, finding islands for now. Let's head to Outset. Yeah, I don't know what's wrong with me that I read Outset and I'm like, yeah, that's not Outset. And then proceeded to do other things for some reason. Alright. Back on the island. If you notice, Link, morning has not broken since we arrived at Great Fish Isle, the land that was so ravaged by monsters. It is as if time itself is frozen. Perhaps this is the curse that Valu spoke of. Whatever the reason, if this night does not end, then we need not worry about the pirates overtaking us. In fact, it might not be a bad idea for you to visit your hometown and family again after such a long time away. You can speak with him after you do. Alright. I'm down to say hi to Grammy. What up, Grandma? I've got... Not only do I have a sword, I now also have bombs. So I'm sure you're very thrilled about that. And yes, I will be lighting them off in the house. Hey, Grandma. Oh, she looks sad and sick. That makes me feel terrible. Oh. Link, Errol, don't go. Don't don't make me cry now, bro. It's, it's 4 p.m., bro. Don't make me cry. Oh. Don't leave. Don't leave your poor old grandma all alone. Bro. I'm right here, Grammy. She's even, like, making... Sounds like she's dying. This is not very fun. Don't make me feel so bad. I had to do it. I like that picture right there. It's a solid picture. Um. This is gonna be mean. Hey, Grandma. <laughs> you like berries? No? Okay. Didn't think so. What do I do? Do I smack her in the face with some- Okay, I can't use that. Why in the world am I able to use bait, but not anything else? 
Am I supposed to bait my grandma? Oh, thank good to be all alone. All right. I. I don't know. Am I supposed to hit her with some like, some like I don't know, sniffing salts, smelling? I don't know. What am I, I don't know what to do about that. But uh, sure. Ooh, is that a gold little rupee? Do I take? I okay. Yeah, I take that. But now I've only got eight rupees left to collect. Oh, that is a fat pig. Didn't I grab you earlier? Dang, he turned out big. Alright, I'm not really sure who we're supposed to see here. He said, go see your family. Well, I, I tried. My grandma's over there in like a weird coma. Oh, Link. Nasty things have been happening. Here at night ever since you left. You better head home early today and don't come out to play until after the sun. Who wants to play? My guy... I just slayed like a 30 meter big scorpion bug. I'm not out here to play, my guy. Alright, we could go back to Orca and see what, see what he's up to. Yeah, I'm not really sure what to do, but you know, well, one thing I am sure of, I'm going to save. And I'm going to take a little break. I've been playing for about like 3-4 hours now, so... I think it's, oops, it's time for me to maybe take a little breather here. Hey everyone, we're continuing Wind Waker, so yeah, let's see what we have to do. Woo. Yo, look at that blue crispy rupee up there, we'll have to visit that. Orca's the sword homie, let's maybe go see if he knows what's going on. Orca, man, why aren't you out here defending the island? You're the swordsman of this island. Ah, Link, you you are all right. Why did you not tell me about Errol? That was thoughtless of you. This island has been has seen hard times ever since you departed. Hmm, I do not know what you have been doing on your journey, but you seem a little more daring these days. That look in your eyes is not the one you left here with. Very good. Show me just how much you've improved in your sword skills. All right. Well, if you guys have watched the rest of the series, I am not known for my. Uh, Combat gameplay here, but we'll give it a whirl. Your skills, the sword, are still at the level of a page. Very good. Try and hit me a hundred times or more before I hit you three times. Okay. How do I? I forgot how I parry again. Oh, okay. I think it might be just the main button. I, by the way, if you guys couldn't tell, I haven't played in a couple weeks, actually. I had to break through this. I had to take a break through to school. So I'm... That was a mistake. So I kind of just got back into the grind here. gotten to like upper 90s a couple times now and I'm kind of starting to feel like a little like a little goofball here that I can't get past it but I believe here we go Psych. why are his legs so short I just noticed the man's got like cu cu cucumber body with absolutely no leg oh I'm not sure why that didn't hit me but hey you never say no to a free free, you know. Whoop. 25. Still three hearts. Here we go. Oh. Try to back up here. Okay. Alright. Back up, back up. Okay. Let's uh, go back to the center of the room here. 
Yeet. Didn't expect that one, did you, old man? Oh, that was an accident. Um, psych, actually, that was completely calculated. Yeet. Everything that I do is 100% calculated. No mistakes. What? Also calculated. <laughs> Is he gonna stop me at 100? Of course I can hit right at 97. Alright, well we're gonna try to keep going as far as we can. I'm actually kinda mad about that hit, I shouldn't have got hit right there. I was too focused on getting to 100. Okay. My boy Link is a Beyblade, dude. He's a boxing god. He's rolling across the floor. Alright. Well, it's the best we've done so far, that's for sure. And you know what? Screw it, man. I'll try to get as high as humanly possible. Get done. Nope. That's a life lost. Hey, honestly, above. Above 150 is pretty good for me. I mean, hey, maybe we can squeak it out to 200 right quick. I need to back up. Back it up, Terry! Alright, we can do that too. That works. Yeet. Calculated. Calculated. Okay, I wanted to back up there, but that works too. Right? I wanna get out of here. Oh, I'm in a... I'm on the table? Back it up! Alright, another large roll. I'm it. Yep, that's it. Woo! That was pretty good, though. Ah, 227 blows. You have improved. I guess it was wrong of me to treat you like you were still a lowly page. You are a page no more. Now you are a knight. Knight, it is not much, but it is now yours. Take this with you. Rupee. 50? Oh, I don't, I don't have any space. No, dude. I'm just spilling rupees, bro. I'm all spaghetti's falling out of my pocket. I got no rupees, uh, just all over the floor. <sighs> Can we go for a higher one? Do you wish to fight me again? No. Okay. No, I'm all right. All right. Um. Yeah, let's continue. But real quick, I've got a uh, cool stuff to do. Shoo, we'll find it eventually. What's going on in this? You guys doing all right, Doug? Like, one of only five people to live here. He is doing cool. He is living. I haven't been eating up my jellies yet. Hey, is that you, Link? Whoa, you kind of startled me there, buddy. I thought more of those monsters had come to harass me. I tell you, there have been a lot of strange things going on here at night lately. I haven't gotten a good night's sleep in ages because of it. And I love sleep. In fact, I saw something really odd just a little while ago. Of course, this was back before the bridge was destroyed. It was up in the fairy woods, near the old dried up fountain. I saw the tall girl who glowed like a fairy, which was odd enough, but then she vanished into the rock. Really, I saw it with my own eyes. Alright. Sounds like that's where we're going, then. Or, I don't know if that's a side quest, or like a real quest, I'm not super sure. But, it's the best lead that we have so far, so screw it. I guess we're going back up to the fairy woods. Which I assume is the thing above me, right? The fairy woods. Um, until sus- Okay, well, that's not gonna stop me. I love broken bridges, those are my favorite types. Ooh, Nanas? No. How about you guys not do that? Yeet. Oops, wrong guy. Gimme. Oh yeah, I'm um, build on Rupees, so... 
not even really much of a point to picking up any of those. I really need to go to that auction to get rid of some of these. Hmm. Well, bridge broken. You? Do you have some insight for me, bud? Oh, so close. If only I could fly to the top of that hill, if only. Beneath that rock head. The truth. Oh, I nearly spoke loud without thinking. It is a secret. Yes, quite a secret. You mean the triforce? Me? I don't know. This seems like it. Again, I want to go for that ruple right now, but like, what's the point? I don't have any space. Um. Okay. So. Hmm. We need to get across the bridge. Now. Yay. How in the world am I gonna do something like that? I don't know, actually. Like, I straight up don't know. I, I would love to give you guys an answer and act like I'm, I know what I'm doing, but I don't. I very much don't. Yay! Oh. Oh, am I gonna die? I love how no matter the fall distance, I still only take, like, a quarter of a heart. Which is funny, considering my little ankles should be absolutely shattered right now. My feet should be inside of my ribcage currently, but... Um, hey... Boat, homie. Do you got any, like, advice? Because I straight up don't know what I'm doing. Hey. What's up? Are you ready? If that is the case, then we must search for the cave around the back. Oh. Oh, okay. Yes, obviously. I thought... I didn't know that was the plan the whole time. Sheesh. Okay, we need the sail. Okay. Yeah, I don't, I don't know why I uh, jumped on land, but whatever. We have to do Orca's thing, at least. Yeah, it should be right around here somewhere. As long as I don't get dragged into that whirlpool, we'll be, we'll be cash. Oh, yes. Yeah, this, this, uh... What's going on? Oh. Do I just need to destroy that before I die? That seems about right. Alright. I need to get closer, probably. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay. A few more. Yeah, I'm gonna assume this is probably what I need to be doing. Well, see, now all of a sudden I... Don't regret all of those bomb upgrades that I've received. All of a sudden, I'm not crying anymore about it. Whoopsies. Yeah, we're fine, we're fine. A few more bangs and more cash. Nice. Magic. like the guy that marks our maps but bad okay I don't understand well met indeed I am pleased to see that you are safe yeah I don't know yeah it seems Ganon has returned there can be no other explanation bro English unfortunately that is not so the one I have brought with me has no connection to the legendary one, and yet I sense great promise in the courage that this one possesses. I do. It is the only way. Yo, I'm loving this background music. This dude's hitting that note hard right now. Nice. Can we water bed now or something? You got Nehru's Pearl. The water spirit was kind enough to give you this jewel. A treasure of the goddesses. Oh. 
So, that foul rain and endless night were indeed elements of the curse brought on us by Ganon. He must intend to cast this land into pure darkness for all time. Yeah, I, I don't know if I could have picked up like a tablet before I came here to understand Big Homie, but like, I... I believe I have. Yeah, maybe if I got better at the game, maybe I could have understood that, but I'm not sure. I guess, I guess we'll never know. Ganon's curse has been broken by the power of the pearl that uh, Jabin, jo Jobin, gave us. So morning should come soon. It is well that we have gathered all of the pearls. Are you ready, Link? I have marked the places where you must set the pearls on your sea chart. Once you have placed each of the pearls in its proper location, the proving grounds for your courage will become apparent. Clearly, the search for, uh, I'm not going to say his name, has shown that Ganon has begun to make efforts to block our path forward. It is certain that the perils ahead will be greater than any you have faced thus far. You should finish any business you have here on Outset Island so that you shall not have any regrets later. Um, well, we kind of just did our rounds on the island and I don't, don't really know what to do, so I think we're pretty much good. Um, where's my map? Where's my map? What in the world? How do I open them? Am I dumb? I should probably not go into that, right? Oh! That sucks for me. Foolish creature who does not fear the gods. To the end of the sea with you, let the winds of Cyclos wrath blow you away. Alright. Do I need bombs? Okay, I don't... Hello? Aim? Not... Okay. Yeah. I couldn't do anything about that one. I don't know if I'm supposed to, like, actually chuck a bomb in his mouth, but, um... I guess we're here now. Link, are you alright? Oh, does my actually... Oh, my controller actually didn't work. So I wasn't just tripping. My straight up, it didn't work. Alright. You would seem that the wind god Cyclos bears some ill will, Ill will towards humans. As you go forward, it would be wise to try not to get sucked up by the Cyclones. Um, but if only we could find a way to harness the power of these Cyclones, then it might be possible for us to travel across the ocean instantaneously. You do not have yet an item that can pierce distant targets. If you did, you might be able to obtain such a power. Keep that in mind. Alright, thank you, homie. But, um... Yeah, I didn't mean to get sucked by that. My controller just stopped working, so that's pretty cool. Yo, Beetle, I got... I need I need some of those berries. I came here last time and he was out of them. Yeah, yeah, I know what I want. Give me these. You're welcome. You're welcome. So, I wish I would have done that before Orca gave me my 50 rupees there, but, um, it's okay. That's a secret chest over there. Um, the other thing that I want to do is maybe we can go to a quick auction. I, I forgot, did the NPC tell me that they're doing them at night? If they're doing it at night, I could, uh, say what's up. Maybe get a little bit of, a get a little of auction action in, if you know what I'm saying. Spend some rupees. Hey, you guys got an auction going on? Well, now, good evening. Yes, I rent out the first floor in order to run a nightly auction. It's about... Oh. It is a competition. Okay, so who um, is being auctioned? Can you outbid everyone else? Do you have the courage? But what is this? Well, do I detect a hint of curiosity? Yeah, what would you, would you, yes, of course, yes, let me spend my money so I don't have to keep losing it. Now, you are completely fine with me not explaining the auction to you, am I correct? You know what, let's go raw dog the auction, we're fine, yeah, good, speed things up, well, alright, yeah, so I don't, I don't need no explanations. 
All oh, these guys look broke. I think we'll be fine. Yes, yes, first let me thank all of you for joining. Uh, what a turnout. The auction is about to begin. What item will pop up? Dear me, I'm so excited. I can't stop sniffling. The calm before the auction storm always makes my nose run. Let's get to this evening. Our glorious auction item is... Treasure chart. Oh my, what a prize at last. Suspense is over, but all the drama aside, you should know it is extremely rare to even get a chance to own a fabulous item like this. It is precious, valuable. Listen well, I do not lie. Let the auction begin. It's open for 60 rupees. I didn't want to do that. I guess we could just do it though. So we need 11 rupees, right? So let's just get, let's do just 100, 119 then. Um, now they'll, they'll be stunned basically up until the end now. I might need to stun them one more time, but I'm not tripping about it because I need to get rid of my rupees anyway, so it's like, whatever. Yeah, they should be stunned up until... Basically, the very end here. And then I'm gonna stun them one last time. So, I need at least 13, I'm just gonna give them 14. Let's just do 140. Yep, man, there we go. Finally, man! Finally, we won this auction. It only took, like, six tries. <laughs> here ends the auction. Tonight's fabulous winner, Link, for 140. Dear me, let me just say congratulations. Also, I have definitely figured out the strat for this. So, stun early, because it's such a low 10%. Stun early, stun in the middle, and then stun at the end. What I just did wasn't perfect. Really, I shouldn't have stunned at the end until just like 5 seconds after that, and it would have just been a free win at like 100. Um, but I... I now know the strat for this. It, it makes sense of what I need to do. So stun early, stun in the middle, stun at the end. Um, try not to let them increase it. Because even this was only 140 compared to like the 180 that we're usually at when I'm not stunning, you know. Um, we'll be lit up, sail to the area. Okay, cool. Okay. Well, 
Now that our rupees are down, we can finally go out into the world and maybe not have to worry about over running on our rubles here, which is, I've already wasted probably like nearly 100 rupees just from losing them. Um, but it is what it is. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to go ahead and grab some lunch. I'm going to run over to the local Little Caesars. See you guys in a little bit.